Hey, welcome to Generation X3, where our one baby boomer, myself, discusses the topics of the day with three millennials sitting over here. And we'll begin with this story, begin and end with this story. Austria bans blonde jokes. This is bull. No, Austria <laughs> bans blonde jokes in fight against terrorism. This is your story, Andre. Okay, so let's forget about terrorism, right? Uh, let me just put it this way. So we're, we're not allowed to be racist, right? We're not to be allowed to be homophobes or whatever. I mean, we are, but we're not allowed to. So why be hateful towards blondes? I mean, it's just another thing. So I, it's fine, yeah. Okay, here's, I believe this is a true okay story. here's a question. If I'm blonde and I'm talking to someone who's blonde, and I make fun of that blonde. Is, so that, ter is that racism? Gitmo for you. That's like, is that that's racism? like a is that black racism? person is calling another black person the N word. Yeah, so that's that totally racism? fine. How are you racist against someone that you're Why do you care what everyone else against? is calling other people? Yeah. Exactly. What do you call They're a blonde, blonde with half a brain? Austria. What do you call a blonde with half a brain? Who have you ever seen Gifted. an Austrian? <laughs> How do you make a blonde's eyes twinkle? Shine a torch in her ear. How many blondes? <laughs> These are old. How many blondes to take the screw in a light bulb? Two. One to hold the light bulb and one to spin the ladder around. Okay. I mean, these are not new jokes. What where, where blonde jokes have been out of vogue for at least a decade? Totally. I mean, people say all the time, like, oh, I had a blonde moment. Maybe they're but just... Like, that's that the end of it. Pretty much, yeah, that's it. Maybe that references all the old blonde jokes that we've ever heard. Well, this is Austria. Maybe they're just realizing. <laughs> <laughs> like, so when you go to... <laughs> like, Oh my so God. when you when you're flying to us, you got to set your time back ten years. Is that yeah. what you're saying? Yeah, oh, yeah, that's a possibility. Oh they God. do. They obviously have never been to Austria. Yeah, they, been to Austria. they're just learning about Duran Duran. I swear. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Whoa. So this is I, we think this is we still think this is a bogus story that you. It's in, was this in the Onion? No, it was not. It was on Mirror.co.co. The Mirror? Yeah. The, the Daily Mail, the Mirror, those are the worst papers. Well, what do you want? It's a good story to talk about. We should see what Arnold Schwarzenegger how, thinks about to, this. What has it got to do with terrorism? Well, I don't know, but they probably the Mirror just titled it that way. What <laughs> terrorists are attacking Well, Austria? but they're afraid that the blondes are going to go nuts because <laughs> they're all blonde in Austria. They're all blonde in Austria. <laughs> <laughs> they blow that something up. I believe. Uh, they make good uh, uh, pastries in Austria. Okay, well, that was enlightening. Uh, you've been watching Generation <laughs> X3.